feel like, you know, try have to try to make it right when I ain't even the one doing nothing. I'm like, if you want to hate me, then fucking just go ahead. You won't be the only one. Shit, I really don't care. <laughs> I don't care. Oh my god, it's just so good. <sighs> person that's attacking me on my illegal marijuana usage is like the tabloids, the tabloids of YouTube. She's fucking advocating illegal drugs. Arrest her, arrest her. And I'm like, but I live in California. Leave me alone. Damn. California, man. <laughs> <coughs> and why is marijuana only illegal in some places and not others? Why is that? Please, someone tell me why. Because it's about somebody's or some collective's opinion. And I just don't want to be part of the collect part of the collective with those people that say, oh, we should outlaw this just because people feel like they're in a euphoric state. And if people want to partake in the marijuana, then fucking let them. No. Shit, there would probably be less war if there was more marijuana smoking. Because I gotta tell you, after smoking, I never even want to argue with anybody. So, I'd be like, alright, yep. It's all good, it's all good. So, you know, smoke more. It's crazy because what this person doesn't realize is that every time you send me a message telling me to stop, this is what I do. on it. I'd be like, ooh, this is so stressful shit. <coughs> <coughs> the grand scheme of things. The grand scheme of things like life, where I end up, what my mission is, what my purpose is or whatever like this person's opinion of me is like this small of it on the whole grand scale and even like on the grand scale of the world even of the universe there's so much more out there than just fucking someone's opinion of me and I don't give a fuck about that shit shit the fuck <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Just makes me think so. You know, people, they just have their opinions of what right is wrong is. And that of it is, of course, is based on, okay, clearly I'm high and I'm stumbling over my words. Let me stop and slow down. <sighs> lots of people have lots of opinions. And some people, their opinions are based on what someone told them their opinion should be. And I just don't live my life that way. I've always been a rebel <laughs> forever. So whatever. I don't care about what's legal and what's not legal. You know what I'm saying? I don't care. You know, at one point, abortion was illegal. You know what I'm saying? And oh my God, if I got pregnant right now, yeah, put my ass in jail because I'm not having another child. 
please, I'm done. I'll be like, can you get it out of me fast? Thanks. Fortunately, I don't really have that problem. So, I'm good. I don't have to be anybody's role model. Don't even worry about it. You know what? Yes. As stupid as we were in our fucking door horror videos, we always, 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 always said, Hey kids, this is why you don't do drugs. We always put our little PSA in there, so shut the fuck up. Yes, I'm still a door horror for life, for life, por vida, forever, for life. People don't even understand what the door horse stood for and the name we don't, don't even know how we got the name the name is more than what it appears to be we're more than what we appear to be you know we got that name in choir because they were singing and putting a W in the middle of the word door the altos and we were making fun of them door horse because that's what they were singing and then we were like, no, they're not cute enough for that. We'll keep it. <laughs> uh, we used to have fun. This is the last thing that I have to let go. Yes. Yes. So that was the very last thing. That's, that was so close to my heart. I mean, seriously. I, this is the one I'm having the most. Like, all the friends and shit tripping on me and shit. Every, everything is just, like, all trippy right now. Okay. I can get over it. But the door whores. The door whores. Please, we could have been the next Cheech and Chong. We could have been the female version of it because... We had good times. We really did have good times. But it's over now, so I have to let it go. me to relax and it helps because sometimes my heart just be beating so fast and I'm like oh my god this cannot be healthy <laughs> it hurts as fast as it is beating and I'm just like what okay let me think think what am I thinking about oh I'm thinking about shit that gets on my nerves I need to calm down so I smoke and it helps me remember to breathe Inhale, exhale, inhale, exhale, take deep breaths and just fucking slow my ass down, that's what I need it for, that's what it's for, <laughs> you know, I can get lost in thought and not, I don't, well, it's a little difficult to explain, but especially when I'm high, I feel like I could just lose myself in my brain. <laughs> I would just talk to myself forever and ever and ever. And I'll do it on YouTube so I can feel like I'm actually talking to people instead of just myself. See how it works? 